Welcome to Liturgy of the Hours with Deacon Kevin. This is a ministry of St. Joseph's Catholic Church in Jacksonville, Florida. Lord, open my lips, and my mouth will proclaim your praise. Come, let us adore Christ the Lord, who promised to send the Holy Spirit on his people. Alleluia! Cry out with joy to the Lord, all the earth. Serve the Lord with gladness. Come before him singing for joy. Know that he, the Lord, is God. He made us. We belong to him. We are his people, the sheep of his flock. Go within his gates giving thanks. Enter his courts with songs of praise. Give thanks to him and bless his name. Indeed, how good is the Lord, eternal his merciful love. He is faithful from age to age. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. Come, let us adore Christ the Lord, who promised to send the Holy Spirit on his people. Alleluia. Sion, sing, break into song, for within you is the Lord, with his saving power. Rise and shine forth, for your light has come, and upon you breaks the glory of the Lord, for the darkness covers the earth, and the thick clouds the people. Zion, sing, break into song, for within you is the Lord with his saving power. But upon you the Lord shall dawn, and in you his splendor shall be revealed. Your light shall guide the Gentiles on their path, and kings shall walk in your brightness. Zion, sing, break into song, for within you is the Lord with his saving power. Wonder and thanksgiving shall fill your heart as the wealth of nations enriches you. You shall be called the city of the Lord, dear to the Holy One of Israel. Sion, sing, break into song, for within you is the Lord with his saving power. You who were desolate and alone, a place unvisited by men, shall be the pride of ages untold and everlasting joy to the nations. Sion, sing, break into song, for within you is the Lord with his saving power. No more shall the sun be your light by day, nor the moon's beam enlighten you by night. The Lord shall be your everlasting light, and your God shall be your glory. Sion, sing, break into song, for within you is the Lord with his saving power. No more for you the setting of suns, no more the waning of moons. The Lord shall be your everlasting light, and the days of your mourning shall come to an end. Sion, sing, break into song, for within you is the Lord with his saving power. You will turn back, O God, and bring us to life and your people will rejoice in you. Alleluia. O Lord, you once favored your land and revived the fortunes of Jacob. You forgave the guilt of your people and covered all their sins. You averted all your rage to calm the heat of your anger. Revive us now, God, our helper. Put an end to your grievance against us. Will you be angry with us forever? Will, you, will your anger never cease? Will you not restore again our life that your people may rejoice in you? Let us see, O Lord, your mercy and give us your saving help. I will hear what the Lord has to say. A voice that speaks of peace, peace for his people and his friends and those who turn to him in their hearts. His help is near for those who fear him and his glory will dwell in our land. Mercy and faithfulness have met. Justice and peace have embraced. Faithfulness shall spring from the earth, and justice look down from heaven. The Lord will make us prosper, and our earth shall yield its fruit. Justice shall march before him, and peace shall follow his steps. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. Show us your mercy, Lord. Our misery is known to us. 
May no evil desires prevail over us, for your glory and love dwell in our hearts. You will turn back, O God, and bring us to life, and your people will rejoice in you. Alleluia. We have placed all our hope in the Lord, and he has given us his peace. Alleluia. A strong city have we. He sets up walls and ramparts to protect us. Open up the gates to let a nation that is just, one that keeps faith. A nation of firm purpose you keep in peace, in peace for its trust in you. Trust in the Lord forever, for the Lord is an eternal rock. The way of the just is smooth, the path of the just you make level. Yes, for your way and your judgments, O Lord, we look to you. Your name and your title are the desire of our souls. My soul yearns for you in the night. Yes, my spirit within me keeps vigil for you. When your judgment dawns upon the earth and the world's inhabitants learn justice. O Lord, you met out peace to us. For it is you who have accomplished all we have done. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. We have placed all our hope in the Lord, and he has given us his peace. Alleluia. The earth has yielded its fruit. Let the nations be glad and sing for joy. Alleluia. O God, be gracious and bless us, and let your face shine and shed its light upon us. So will your ways be known upon earth, and all nations learn your saving help. Let the peoples praise you, O God, let all the peoples praise you. Let the nations be glad and exult, for you rule the world with justice. With fairness you rule the peoples. You guide the nations on earth. Let the peoples praise you, O God, let all the peoples praise you. The earth has yielded its fruit. For God, our God, has blessed us. May God still give us his blessing till the ends of the earth revere him. Glory to the Father and to the Son and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. Be gracious and bless us, Lord, and let your face shed its light on us so that we, can make you known with reverence and bring forth a harvest of justice. The earth has yielded its fruit. Let the nations be glad and sing for joy. Alleluia. A reading from Acts chapter 13. God raised Jesus from the dead, and for many days thereafter Jesus appeared to those who had come up with him from Galilee to Jerusalem. These are his witnesses now before the people. We ourselves announce to you the good news that what God promised our fathers he has fulfilled for us, their children, in raising up Jesus according to what is written in the second psalm. You are my son, this day I have begotten you. The Lord is risen from the tomb. Alleluia, alleluia. The Lord is risen from the tomb. Alleluia, alleluia. He hung upon the cross for us. Alleluia, alleluia. Glory to the Father and to the Son and to the Holy Spirit. The Lord is risen from the tomb. Alleluia, alleluia. The Lord has risen from the dead as he promised. Let all the earth rejoice and be glad, for he shall reign forever. Alleluia. Blessed be the Lord, the God of Israel. He has come to his people and set them free. He has raised up for us a mighty Savior, born of the house of his servant David. Through his holy prophets he promised of old that he would save us from our enemies, from the hands of all who hate us. He promised to show mercy to our fathers and to remember his holy covenant. This was the oath he swore to our father Abraham, to set us free from the hands of our enemies, free to worship him without fear, and holy and righteous in his sight all the days of our life. You, my child, shall be called the prophet of the Most High. For you will go before the Lord to prepare his way, to give his people knowledge of salvation by the forgiveness of their sins. In the tender compassion of our God, the dawn from on high shall break upon us, 
to shine on those who dwell in darkness and the shadow of death, and to guide our feet into the way of peace. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. The Lord has risen from the dead as he promised. Let all the earth rejoice and be glad, for he shall reign forever. Alleluia. Christ the Lord promised to send us from the Father, their Holy Spirit. Let us give Christ glory and ask, Lord Jesus, give us your Spirit. Lord Jesus, may your word dwell in us in all its richness, that we may thank you in psalms, hymns, and spiritual canticles. Through the Spirit you have made us children of God. Grant that through the Spirit we may join with you in always calling on God as Father. Give us wisdom in our daily lives, that we may do everything for God's glory. You are patient and full of compassion. Make us live at peace with all mankind. With longing for the coming of God's kingdom, let us offer our prayer to the Father. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come. Thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. God of power and mercy, send your Holy Spirit to live in our hearts and make us temples of his glory. We ask this through our Lord Jesus Christ, your Son, who lives and reigns with you and the Holy Spirit, one God, for ever and ever. Amen. The Lord be with you and with your spirit. May Almighty God bless you, the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Amen. Go in peace. Thanks be to God.